everybody. Welcome back. Thanks for joining your virtual drinking buddy. So, tonight, on Old Man Drinking Beer, Naughty Maryland. This is by Crystal Springs Brewing Company out of Boulder, Colorado. Uh, let's get in the stats here. 8.2% alcohol by volume. An IBU of 29 uh, spice, citrusy fruit, alcohol it, with an ABV of 8.2. Yeah, you're going to notice some alcohol. And it says it's temptably, temptingly drinkable yet devious. So I'm not really sure what that means, but oh no, let's dive right into it. I'm not smelling citrus. Oh, there it is. Yeah, it's kind of more of a nondescript citrus, not real specific citrus fruit per se. Don't necessarily smell the alcohol, but at 8.2, it's probably going to rock my world. Mm. Oh, that's good. There's a good balance of, of the spice and the fruity flavor real clean drinking beer you don't actually taste the alcohol so much it's not a, a real boozy beer even with as strong as it is yeah actually that's just a real well-balanced beer it's a Belgian style ale so um, I don't know Belgian ales um, can be on the stronger side. Yep, I'm having a hard time placing the citrus. Oh, and my grill is smoking, so I should probably wrap this video up and get to my food. Um, so again, this is Naughty Marilyn. Got some, some high heels and a Whip, I don't know if you could see the can real well. Uh, reminds me more of Betty Page than any Marilyn I know. Maybe Marilyn Manson. I think he was prone to wearing high heel boots and probably been flogged a time or two in his day. Oh, um, probably should talk about food pairings. I better take another drink. Honestly, for me, this is more of like a celebration beer. The And it's actually great for this time of year. The type of spices they have, it's it's on the more mild side than some like, um, I don't know, winter beers or Christmas beers. But it's got similar spices to that. So I think it would be great to have <clears throat> with, uh, like if, if you were having family over for the holidays. I think it would be a great beer to share with people. I mean, it's strong. You wouldn't want to have a lot of them, but if you could get your hands on a six pack of them and share them with your family, even have smaller glasses with a stronger beer like this. I don't necessarily like to have a lot of that beer, but the flavor is really good. I've had, you know, I've had strong beers that the flavor is good, but you just you can't do a lot of them that or you're going to regret it the next day. So. Probably where this beer is at 8.2%. But, yeah, if, if you've got a, a gathering or, like, if you're at the brewery, if you're at Crystal Springs Brewery, and I, I would work one of those into your evening, um, maybe in amongst some other lighter beers, and probably with some food, too. So, um, but, yeah, food, it probably, I don't know, I think it would probably go well with you know, your traditional Thanksgiving dinner or Christmas dinner, your ham, your turkey, all that sort of stuff. Um, honestly, now that I'm drinking this, I'm kind of getting a craving for oysters. So like maybe oysters on a half shell, just throwing that out there. But regardless, it is a delicious beer. I'm going to have one more drink, see if there's anything else I can think of to say about this. Nope, it's just really good. So, if you're at all interested, I'll leave a link in the description. Um, this is a beer drop 
beer, so I suppose I should read the can. Some of them are exclusively for beer drop. Oh, here's a fun little thing. Naughty Maryland is a marriage of flavors. Spice, citrusy fruit, alcohol. She is simply drinkable yet devious. If you have one, you'll want another. I probably would want another and then be feeling it very quickly. So, um, again though, uh, I got this for beer drop, it, but they're out of Colorado. So if you're in Colorado, I don't know that they, um, if they have distribution outside of the state, but, but if you're in Colorado, I would definitely check this out. I think it would be a great holiday beer. And if not, if you're not in Colorado, go ahead and check out Beer Drop. I'll leave a, a referral link and a, a link just to the website just so that you can look around, kind of see what they offer, check out the different plans. And... What the fuck is that? It's the joys of filming outside. Um, but as I was saying, Check out the different links. If you're going to order Beer Drop, I would definitely use a referral link. You will get $10 off your first order. Uh, just something to think about. Until then, this... Come on! I don't know what that is. I, I, I swear, it's just somebody out being a dick. As I was saying, this is the Malta gentleman reminding you, you only have one liver. So use it wisely.